years here in Germany. And they are involved in killing more dolphins that die in the cove in Japan and all of the dolphinariums in Europe and America put together with this can of tuna right here. So we're asking the consumers, do not buy products from Etica until they stop buying dolphins that are uh, tuna that is killed by chasing dolphins. And we have absolute proof that that's going on. There's no question about it. Etica is very involved in killing dolphins, many, many dolphins, thousands of them. So please, consumers, don't shop there until they change. They'll change very quickly if consumers in Germany stop, stop buying from them. You'll see it change very quickly. You'll see a dolphin safe label on this can, a verifiable safe label once the consumers in Germany, and I'm sure they will. People in Germany are very, very good about this, and Holland and Switzerland. I couldn't do this in South America. It wouldn't work, but it will work in Germany. Erika, buy this direction <coughs> in Colombia, and we will prepare uh, start a campaign against Erika to stop this. Yeah, this was the letter. Uh, it says so we wish to uh, state the situation as we understand it at this point. We have documented Etica has continued to import tuna throughout 2011 from SeaTech, a company that chases, nets, and kills dolphins in order to catch tuna. Etica continues to sell this dolphin unsafe tuna in Germany. So, in order to try and s silence us, they filed a lawsuit in Italy, and the judge slammed it. The judge threw it out. Judge slams SeaTech's effort to weaken the dolphin safe label tuna. Lawsuit against Earth Island backfires. I mean, we have, I wouldn't be saying this because it's a very serious allegation, but uh, this problem can be solved real quick if the German public get involved. The consumers, again, it's all up to the consumers. Thank you.